Hello, Tree. Can you hear me? Yes. All right. So, how are you? I'm fine. Can you put a little lower your camera? Okay. Thank you. All right. Nice seeing you, Tree. And now we're going back to our lesson. Did you do your assignment? No. Okay. Let's check your assignment. Okay, uh, let's start with the first assignment. Um, were you able to write about your dream house? Three? Yeah. Did you write an assignment, an essay about your dream house? Yes. Okay, can you read to me your dream house? Yeah. Yeah. Can you read it loud? Okay. My dream house is why about Four hundred metres. It looks like a cat. It has four floors and one garden. Inside, it has seven rooms. Um, one a living room, a kitchen, three bedroom, and a computer room. Bathroom. In my dream house, the living room is the largest room. It has one big TV, four armchairs, and two sofas. In kitchen, it has it five has. wood chairs. It has five wood chairs and one big wood table. Mm. In my grandma's bedroom has one small TV and one long bed. And my computer room has one big computer. Mm -hmm. Here the computer room is my mom's bedroom. Inside has one big TV, wardrobe to put some clothes and the last is my bedroom. It, it has about cells. I put clothes on it. And outside has one two big flower tree. And the bed mm -hmm. has a picture of the golden trees. Yeah. Okay. Um, can you take a picture of your essay then send it to the group chat? Okay, after after the class, after the class, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, after the class, ask your mother to take a picture of your assignment and send it to the group, okay? Okay. All right. So thank you very much, Three. That's very interesting. Having a house with seven rooms, right? Many rooms, right? Yeah. All right. So that's beautiful. Okay, now, what about the next assignment? The complete the sentences. Were you able to get, uh, do that? Were you able to do that? No. No? Ah, only that assignment, only the dream house. You only, you only finished the dream house? Yeah. Oh, I see. It's all right if it's the case, okay? All right. Let me share my screen. And let's have the new topic already, okay? See my screen? Yes. Okay, great. We're going to have a new topic. Okay. Can you read it? Guys who lives here. 
Okay, guess who lives here? Guess who lives here? Good job. All right. Okay, let's start with the vocabulary tree. Okay. CD. CD. Good job. Lamp. Lamp. Snail. Snail. Spider. Spider. Okay, can you say the words again? Spider. Uh, from the top, CD. Can you start with CD? CD. Mm -hmm. Lamp. Snail. Spider. Okay, good job. Let's go to the next one. Okay, try to look and read and write whether yes or no. Okay, there, are, there is a picture here. Can you see the picture? Yes. Okay. How many bats are there? There are seven. There are seven? Yeah. Okay, let's try to check. Uh, can you put circle to see if there are seven? Can you put circle? Okay, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so there are seven. The answer here. Okay, good. There are seven. Now, are there any people inside this room? Are there any people inside this room? No. 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 Do you think people live in this house? Do you think people live in this house? No, because it's dirty now. Yeah, it's dirty, right? It's very dirty and a lot of bats live there. Okay. Is it this uh, is it in the center of a city? Or in the country? Hmm. I think it's in the country. Okay, uh, you guess. I guess so too. Okay, you have one minute to look at the picture. Try to remember where the bats are. Okay. okay. I'm going to give you one minute. Try to remember where the bats are, okay? Okay. All right. So let's start. Okay. Can you read number one? The biggest bat in the picture is lying below the fan. And the answer there is yes. Okay. What about number two? Can you read it? Well, there's a green bag at the bottom of the stairs and it's sleeping. And what's your answer? It's no, it's a one green bag is sleeping. Okay, good job. It's a gray bag. No, okay, number three. Two bags are outside the house. It's no. It's okay. Only one bag. It's only one bath. Good job. Number four. 
you can see a bat in front of the window. Yes. Yes. Good job. There is a bat in front of the window. Number five. The smallest bat in the bigger is on top of the phone is now. In the top of the phone. What's your answer? It's no. No? Yes. Okay, good. Where is it then? Where is the smallest bat? It's in front of the window. Okay, it's front of the window. Number six. In this picture, we can only see one spider. What's your answer? Yes. Yes, yes, that's true. Number seven. The bag with about the whole table is brown. Okay. No, it's black. It's black? Good job. Number eight. Most of the bag are inside the house. What's your answer? Yes. Good job. You got perfect score three. You have a very good memory. Give me a high five. All right. Very smart. So proud of you. All right. Okay. Good job. Good job. Okay. The smallest bat. You say it's in front of the window. What about yeah. this one? Is this the smallest bat, do you think? Yeah. So it's in between the paintings right okay now let's go to the next part now let's correct the mistakes in two three five seven now okay uh don't have you don't have to do that because you already say the question okay for this one too the bath black is slipping at the bottom of the strayers isn't green it's green Okay, good. It's gray. Oh, sorry. It's purple. But it looks gray as well to me. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. All right. Number three. Only one bat. Which outside the door. Okay. Are you sure which outside the door? Are you sure? Only one bat. Are you sure with your answer? Which? Which? Only one bad wish outside the door. Okay, the correct answer there is actually is outside the house, okay? Yeah. All right, so let's go to number five. The smallest part in the picture is on the walls between the two pictures. Very good. It's on the wall between the two pictures. Good job. And that's the number seven. The back wish is above the, the The phone. Sorry, which is above the phone table. Home table. Yeah, phone table. Can you spell that word? P H O N E. Phone table. Okay. Mm -hmm. And can you continue? Is is black. Okay, let's try to check. Hall table. You can also call this one this hall table because actually this one is a hall. And this this one is still called a hall table. Okay? Yes. And it's black. Oh, why is it says here it's pink? I think it's a bat 
on the wall. No, no, no. Actually, the bath on this one, ceiling, is the pink. Actually, the correct answer is black for that case, if this one. Oh, above the whole table. Yeah, because if this one is on the table, right? If we're going to look at this, it should be on the whole table. But we're talking about this one above. So that's color pink. Okay, three? Okay. Okay, let's try to learn some prepositions. I know you know this one. Let's have a quick review, three. Can you read it? Before. After, before. He drinks. Opposite. 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 Can you say again? All right. From. Right. Okay, good. Let's try to read some prepositional phrases. Add the back off. At the back of. In front of. In front of. Okay. At the end. At the end. At the end. Good job. At the top of or on top of. At the top of or on top of. Okay, good. Are the word at at the bottom of. At the bottom of. Okay, good job. And last word. At home. Okay. So that is at home. Good job, three. So let's go to the next part. Okay, now we're going to do some listening and draw lines between the names and the bats. Okay, three, are you ready? Okay. okay, which bath do you think is quick, cloud, dream, teeth, and sandwich? Look at sandwich. It's at the back of the room, in front of the window. So that is sandwich, okay? Can you see this? This bath is sitting on the whole table. It's watching the big bat fly. Who is teeth? Yeah. Can you put the line? Okay. Where's the line for teeth three? Do you know how to put line? Okay, I will share my screen then. Oh, no, no. Can you do it? Sitting on the whole table. Hmm? Sitting on, not above. Sitting as well. Sitting on the whole table. Okay, good. Next one. Good job, Daddy's teeth. Oh dear, Dream is slipping again. It's on the floor at the bottom of the stairs. Where is Dream? Yeah, it's me. Okay, that is Dream, okay? Good job. Next. Look at cloud above the phone. Its pink body and face are so beautiful. Look at cloud above the phone. Its pink body and face are so beautiful. Where is cloud? Yeah, Again, the cloud floor. above the phone. It's pink. You know, color pink? Color pink? Teacher Angel is wearing color pink. Yeah. 
Above the phone. Where is it above? Yeah. Okay, good. All right. So that is cloud. Okay, last. Quick is coming into the house. It's flying very quickly like it always does. Can you see it in the open door? Okay. Okay, so that is quick. Wow, good job. You got perfect. Okay, good job, good job. Okay, do you have any questions so far, Tree? No. Okay, can you read this one by one? Look at sandwich. Look at sandwich. It's on the back of the room in front of the window. Can you see it? It is. This bat is sitting on the whole table. It's watching the big bat fly. Mm -hmm. Next. Oh dear, Green is sleeping again. It's on the floor at the bottom of the stair. You know cloud about the phone? This big body and face are so beautiful. Okay. Green is coming into the house. It's flying very quickly, like it always does. Yes. Can you see it in the open door? Okay, good. Okay, very nice. Three, you got perfect score one more time. Good job, good job. Okay, so let me remove. Okay, read. And then write the name of the people who live in each flat. Okay, do more people in your country live in houses or flats? Three? Yeah. Are, are people, are the people in your country live in, live in houses or flats? Live in houses. Almost live in house, not in flats. I see. This house is in the center of a city called Tall Town. There are six flats in this house. Read about the people who live in these flats. Okay, but before that, kindly answer the question. Do you think they like living there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Would you like to live there? Would you like to live in a flat? No, I like it being in the house. Oh, why? Why? Yes. Because all the house is is held by my family. Mm -hmm. All right, that's nice. Okay, can you see the text three? Yes. Yeah. Okay, can you read it loud? Mr. and Mr. and Miss White. This is why. This is why live at the bottom of the stairs below Mary Green. The White family like cooking a lot. They often invite friends to their flat and they have dinner party. Anna and Bill Brown love reading quietly in their living room. They don't like Living about Miss Green because she likes spending the music when she comes home after work. Miss Green lives up 
offset her friends Mary Bring. They are both learning to play the guitar and they make a lot of noise. Your race class under Miss Prince. He doesn't have to grip to right. work because, right to work because he was on his website at home, but he rides around the park on his bike every morning first. The nearest person in this house is Lucy Blue. He moved into the flat at the top of the stair. Two floors above me, the uh, and Mrs. Wise ap apartment. Okay, apartment. Okay. Can you just read that? Apartment. Apartment. Okay, so let me read it for one more time. Mr. and Mrs. White live at the bottom of the stairs below Mary Pink. The White family like cooking a lot. They often invite friends to their flat and they have dinner parties. Anna and Bill Brown love reading quietly in their living room. They don't like living above Miss Green because she plays very loud music when she comes home after work. Miss Green lives opposite her friend Mary Pink. They are both learning to play the guitar and they make a lot of noise. John Gray's flat is under Mrs. Miss Green's. He doesn't have to drive to work because he works on his website at home, but he rides round the park on his bike every morning first. The newest person is the newest person in this house is Lucy Blue. She moved into the flat at the top of the stairs. Two floors above Mr. and Mrs. White's apartment. Okay, so let's continue. Can you tell me on the how on each flat who lives there? Okay, can you write it? Three. Can you put the writing? Do you understand my instruction three on what to do? You're going to write the answers here, okay? Who lives here, okay? Okay. Okay, so try answering it. Three, do you know what to do? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to wait for you, okay? So I will give you the answer for number one. So we have there Anna and Bill Brown. Okay, we already have Miss Green. What else? Okay, so we have there John Gray. Okay. 
Okay, so that is to say that is to see blue. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, good job. And who's the one in front of them? I mean, above them. Who is next to Miss Green? What is the name? Is Mary Pink. Okay. Do you know how to write Mary Pink? Mm. Okay, good. Okay, and lastly, we have Nita and Miss White. Okay. Okay, good job. But let's try to correct some answers, three. Okay. Can you read this part? But the Miss and Nita and Miss White keep at the bottom of the stack. Bottom? What do you mean by bottom, three? Can you read that? Where is Mr. and Mrs. White live? They are living at the... At the bottom of the stair below Mary Pink. Okay. So if it's Mary Pink here, then they should be below, right? Yeah. So Mr. and Mrs. White supposed to be here, okay? Mm. Okay. So try to correct it next time, okay? Next one. Um, what about Lucy? What about Lucy? Miss Green lives opposite, opposite, opposite her mm -hmm. friend Mary Green. Lucy, Lucy, we're talking about Lucy, Lucy Blue. Where is Lucy Blue? Where is Lucy Blue? Where is Lucy Blue Tree? Mm. She is opposite is opposite Miss Green Flat. Miss Green Flat? Okay, Lucy Blue is in Mary Pink. Opposite of Miss Green is Mary Pink, right? What about Lucy Blue? Lucy, where is Lucy Blue? Lucy is Lewis. John Ray's flat. Okay. 
for this one, Mr. and Mrs. White live here. Okay, Mr. and Mrs. White is here. They are at the bottom of the stairs. Okay, can you write here, Mr. and Mrs. White? So, Mr. and Mrs. White are next to John Gray. Okay? Okay, good job. Okay, good. And where is Lucy? Is on the top. The okay. Floor. Okay, on the third floor, right? Next to Anna and Bill Brown. It's on the top of the uh, mud in left. Sorry. Anna and Bill Brown is on the top of the mm -hmm. flat, but is on the right left. Okay, good job, good job. All right, so that is the correct one. Can you give me a high five, three for giving you for doing good job? High five, good job. All right, let's go next. All right, good job. Nice one, nice one. Okay, now let's go to the next part. Okay, which room is this? Okay, people cook in this room and they sometimes eat here, eat there. Okay, that's kitchen, good job. We have a shower and a wash, then dry our bodies here. Where is it? It's bathroom. Okay. People have sit, sorry, people sit at the table and have lunch for, sorry, and lunch or dinner in this time. People sit at the table and have lunch or dinner in this room. Where is this tree? Do you know what room is it? Big room? No, no, no. You don't call it big room. You call it dining room. Can you say it? Dining room. Okay, good. It's bedroom. Okay, good. It's bedroom. People sleep in this room and they sometimes get dressed there. Good job. And, that, and next, people sit and watch TV in this room. Is living room. Okay, good job. You call that living room. Okay. Okay, let's try to find um, alphabet. Um, how many letters are there in the alphabet tree? What's your answer? There are. How many alphabets? Okay, there are 26. How many? It's 26. Okay, this is what we're going to do. Let's find things in the picture that starts with letter C. Let's find things in the picture that begin with the letter C. Mm, uh, Can you see? A chair. Letter C. Letter C. This chair. 
Okay, so one is chair. What else? Chair, what else? What about this one? Computer. Yes, of course, computer. What about this one? Is CD. Yes, yeah, CD. Of course, computer. What else? Okay, no more. What about letter B? B? Yes, B. Yeah. What is that? Bed. Okay, good. Bed, definitely. And next, you can also have this one. What do you call this one? Couple. Books. Three, what is it? You call this? Books. Mm -hmm. Of course, we have the word bed. Good job. What about this one? This bag. Okay. For that case, we're going to stop it here first. Okay, it's already time. Thank you very much for coming to last three. Okay, so thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye now. Bye. Okay, see you.